of the materials that I love to use the most is a New York bluestone. It's a tumbled bluestone, which means basically the stone is cut, it's naturally cut and broken, and then it's tumbled, almost in, I, I believe it's a kind of like a large dryer, and it tumbles the block and wears off the edges. So instead of having these really sharp edges, we get this nice soft edge. What it does for us is it gives, it softens up that whole edge of the pool, still allows us the, the creativity and, and flexibility to kind of jigsaw pieces together, but it gives a really nice edge that then blends well with any type of surface that we use beyond that, which very typically what we do almost exclusively is a textured, kind of stamp textured pool or concrete. And that tends to work the best for slipperiness as well as overall looks. We can play with the colors and get a lot of really cool effects that will go well with the bluestone. The other part that I tend to really like about the bluestone is it allows our tile selections to match really well. Because it has some diversity in it, we can use a tile that has diversity. And if, you, if you're looking for something that's completely uniform, bluestone would not be for you because it's, there's shades and there's varieties of it. it it's, there's a, it's rich in iron content. So you're gonna get some darks and you're gonna get some almost reddish colors and certainly some palettes of it have more of a greenish hue versus blue. But with that variation of color, which nature rarely makes something one color. Nature is, is the, the best example of how things can be blended together and look really well because you look through nature, there's no one thing that's just one color. It's, it's, a shade, it's shades of a color. And that's where Bluestone helps us, is it allows us to then pick a tile that also has shades, it has variation, and it doesn't become too uniform. Because we, with what we do, are not looking for uniformity, we're looking for uniqueness, we're looking for those special elements. And the tile is one of those pieces as well, we're not looking for just straight blue anymore. We're now looking for all different shades of taupes and yellows and greens and, and blues and, and everything, but blended together. The Bluestone allows us to blend those together really well because it in, itself, in and of itself has very different shades in it.